Yes, the global slowdown has some impact on the Thai economy. As we saw last year, that we grew about 2.8 percent. But this year, yes, we expect the growth about 2.8 to 3 percent with the improvement on the uh, global trade. So our export should be uh, performing better. At the same time, uh, the tourism, uh, last year we saw 28 million people uh, visiting Thailand, which is about compared to the 40 million peak in 2019. Uh, this year we expect about 35 million, so 75 percent level. I think the combination of both the export sector, domestic spending, together with tourism should uh, help us to be able to grow reasonably well this year. There has been a lot of talk and anticipation of interest rates, policy moves. Uh, we have the Prime Minister of Thailand uh, putting the Bangkok, the, excuse me, the Bank of Thailand under pressure to cut rates to help boost the economy. Uh, we've seen the Bank of Thailand halt for eight straight interest rate increases. The next meeting is February the 7th. As far as what the Prime Minister wants to do, is this the right move? So far, I have to say that the measures that the, our central bank of Thailand has been taking has been quite cautious. You could see that the interest rate movement and the level of our interest rate is uh, official rate at 2.5 percent, which is among the lowest in the region, actually among the lowest in the world. So I have taken quite cautious approach in order to make sure that it has minimal impact on the economy. At the same time, be able to address the inflationary pressure which at the moment is very well uh, under control uh, thanks to the monetary policy as well as also many of the measures the government has taken to alleviate the pressure on the uh, living cost. So I think together with the stable exchange rate, I think later on probably we will be able to see some movement in the interest rate downward uh, somewhat. But so far I think uh, the central bank has done a great job. As far as the Prime Minister is concerned, do you think there's any impact on investor confidence in Thailand, given his, uh, his intentions for the Bank of Thailand? I think uh, the Prime Minister has done a very great job in uh, going out to the world, visiting and see many uh, potential investors to come and make long-term investment in Thailand and use Thailand as the hub uh, for the connectivity uh, to the ASEAN country and also into Asia. He has been making visits to different countries, uh, whether in uh, Asia, in Japan, to the China, in Europe and the US, and also visiting many companies. I think that should bear fruit. Uh, we should be able to see some few good new investments uh, into the country, which then will propel a subsequent investment later on. Full year net profit at Bangkok Bank up 42 percent, boosted by net interest income. If rates come down and when they do, what is the outlook? The improvement on the net interest income uh, came at this point. Actually, if you look back a few years ago under the COVID, that interest level has come down, was down quite significantly. Part of that also part of the monetary policy to help the overall economy of the country so that the real sector would be able to afford and go through the uh, shock in the, uh, because of the COVID pandemic. Uh, 